Mm, savoring the moment. Do, 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 do. Come on, baby. Okay, pretty anticlimactic. All right, I went for the purple one just because I'm a sucker for purple. Let's see if it disappoints. dirty already that is it's not as purple as I would have liked it to be could have been a little bit more purple let's check out the box we have the instructions yeah you get the 20 watt same charger as the iPad Pro now they're both USB-C. Isn't that wonderful? One less charger. I am supposed to have like a felt thing. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's check it out. Starting on the sides. Nice. The stereo speakers. I have a feeling I'm gonna love stereo speakers on this little device. The only thing I'm wondering about these stereo speakers is how they're gonna perform when I'm holding it, but I guess it's, it's like four of them. So if I cover two, it should still be good. And we have the USB-C charging port. Now this USB-C is only Gen 1, so it's only five gigabits per second. The Apple Pencil magnetic hold. Let's just let's just try this because I've been waiting for this. Oh. That is, oh, it's good, strong. Feels almost stronger than the iPad Pro, but it's probably because it's so lightweight, like less than 300 grams. I can drag the whole thing just by the pen. I cannot drag the iPad Pro with just a pen. I do have an iPad on it though, let's try it. No, nope, so this, I think maybe I could even Damn, son, that is, that's some strong ass magnets. <laughs> Damn. Top. Touch ID sensor, volume rockers. Feels good. This also feels good. Here, I'm not sure you, you guys can see it. Maybe if I do it like this, the new and improved camera. I don't have the M1 iPad Pro version, so I've never used this center stage function. It's gonna be fun to try it out. I don't do a lot of Skyping or Teams meetings and stuff like that. I don't think it's going to be a super useful feature for me, but maybe for you. I don't know. And then we're back on the other side. Such a subtle color. Holding it feels great. I'm a little concerned with the bezels. So thin now. I'm afraid I'm going to cover it with my fatty fingers, but it's also so light that I could just support it from behind and beneath and on one side. Yeah. I could even just lock it in with my fleshy thumb meat. Mm. We'll see. Those stereo speakers. I'm going to be comparing the speakers on the uh, iPad mini 6, the iPad mini 5, and the iPad Pro and previous gen iPad. Maybe it's the previous previous one. I'm going to take all the iPads from the entire family and I'm gonna do a speaker test. Unlocking it. I like the old, but I mean this can probably be the same. It's very natural to grab the iPad mini 5 like this and unlock it or just when it was on the table you just this is I don't know since it's so light you're gonna have to Apply pressure from the other side. Nitpicking. Very, very much nitpicking. The volume rockers, I don't know. It was good to have them. I, I, I understand why they moved them. And I mean, if that's the price you have to pay for being, being able to use the second gen Apple Pencil, then so be it. It's worth it. Gen 2. Thank the Lord. 
Gen 1 pencil was like a hassle. It's never charged when you want to use it. You're in the moment and then it's out of power, no battery. And then you have to charge it and when you charge it, you don't want to move it around. You know, I'm afraid I'm gonna break it just by looking at it. Now in this series on the iPad mini, I want to do a couple of things. First, we have the unboxing. And then as soon as this unboxing is over, I'll be starting to daily drive this beauty for a full review. Instead of just one review where I determine if this tablet suits my needs, I want to know about your needs. If you're a photographer, for example, there's the new A15 chip and the USB-C port and a slightly bigger screen mean you can go light. If you're a student, is this the only tablet slash computer you need? So what's your use case? Let me know in the comments. And if you have any other questions about the new Mini, post them in the comments as well, and I'll try to answer them in the review. Until next time.